Hello students, today we will be solving some of the problems based on areas of combination of plane figures. So in order to solve the problems, you will have to know some of the areas. So the first one is area of a square, which is a square, area of a circle, pi r square, area of a semicircle is half of pi r square, area of a quadrant. See, this is a circle is divided into 4 equal parts. So, 1 by 4 into pi r square. Area of a triangle is equal to half into base into height. Area of an equilateral triangle is equal to root 3 by 4 a square. Area of a rectangle is equal to length into breadth. So, children, today I will be solving one or two problems and the remaining sums I have prepared the notes and put it in the description box. Please make a note of it. Okay. Find the area of the shaded region in the given figure where ABCD is a square of side 14 cm. See this is 14 cm. You will have to find the area of the shaded region. See this is the shaded region. You are able to see the shaded region. How are you going to find the area of shaded region? See here. Area of shaded region is equal to in the given figure what they have given? They have given you a square. So I will find the area of a square minus see in the whole square if I am going to remove this four circles the remaining part is the shaded part. Okay. So Minus area of area of a circle. But totally you have 4 circles. So directly I will write here only 4 into area of a circle. Now let me write on the data what all is given. They have given for a square. They have given the side. A is equal to 40 centimeter. Then. For the circle, for the circle, see what will be the diameter of the circle here, diameter of one circle, because the whole square is divided into four equal circles. So the diameter of one circle will be equal to uh, 7 by, uh, what is this, 14 by 2. Okay, 14 by 2 which is equal to 7 centimeters. And what will be your radius? Radius will be equal to 7 by 2 centimeter. Okay. Now, I know what is the formula to find area of a square. Already we have mentioned here previously. Area of a square is a square minus 4 times. Area of a circle is pi r square. And what is your a? 14. 14 square minus 4 into pi. Nothing is mentioned here. So I can take it as 22 by 7 into r. r is 7 by 2 into 7 by 2. So let's cancel. 2 11s are 7, 7, 2 1s are 2 2s are 4. So 14 square is 196 minus 2 into 11 into 7. 77. This is equal to 196 minus 14, 154. If you are subtracting 6 minus 4, 2. 9 minus 5, 4. 42 centimeter square. Uh, look here children. See, uh, in the previous one I have solved the complete sum. But now I will just brief you how to do it. Suppose... If there is a square and there are two semicircles, how are you going to find the shaded region? This is your shaded region. Okay. Area of shaded region is equal to area of a square minus, since there are two semicircles, you are writing two times area of a semicircle and then you will be writing the formula for all this. You know that area of a square is a square and then area of semicircle is equal to 1 by 2 pi r square. You are going to substitute the values and get the answer. And uh, so in the previous one, angle was not given. 
So we were just using the formula and writing it. And in this case, say I have drawn two concentric circles. I think you know what is concentric circles. Concentric circles are the circles with the same center but different radial. Okay. So there are two concentric circles. I have given it as O, A, B, C, D is a sector. They have given the radius of one circle is 14 centimeter and the radius of another circle is 7 centimeter and the angle is 40 degree. So how are you going to find the shaded region? See this is your shaded region. So area of shaded region is equal to area of this big sector, area of sector OAB minus area of this smaller sector OCD. So if you are going to subtract these two sectors, you will get the area of shaded region. So we have discussed in the previous uh, exercises, that is what is the formula to find area of a sector and everything. So we will write on the formula, theta by 360 into pi r square and minus for this also the same thing. We we'll just substitute the value and get the answer. Uh, so children, you, if, you, if at all you have any comment regarding my teaching or the notes which I have which are provided, you are uh, you can you can uh, put it in the comment section. I'll be ready to answer you. Thank you.